हाई फ्रेंड्स वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू आज सुबह मेरा एक इंटरव्यू था एंड आई डोंट नो वट एवर आई स्पोक इन दैट इंटरव्यू इट टर्न आउट रियली ब्यूटिफुल आई डोंट नो आई थिंक यू विल लव दैट इंटरव्यू ऑफ माइंड सो दैट लेडी केम शी हैड अ कॉफी एंड देन शी स्टार्टेड क्वेश्चनिंग मी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन टू मी वॉज वॉट वॉज द थिंग दैट यू रिमेंबर दैट मेड यू वेरी वेरी हैप्पी इन लाइफ the happiest moments of your life what was the happiest thing that happened to you so i kept quiet for about 30 seconds 1 minute so she said is that really a difficult one so i just looked at her i gave her a smile and i said no it's not a difficult one but what i can try and remember right now is there were five moments in my life so she said okay you can share them with me and i'll want to make a note of them so she asked me what was the first one first time it was i very clearly remember me my mother and my father the three of us in a hill station in shimla it was my birthday if i'm not mistaken it was my 11th i was 11 years old and there were no lights lights chali gayi thi it was more like a village at that point of time my father was in the evening about to go and get the cake there was a cake shop there but uh, i don't know whatever it happened that the shop closed and there was a lot of snow there were no lights so it was me my mother and my father sitting and my mother and father said chalo aaj iska birthday kitchen mein banate hain my mother making mutton chops for me and uh, she making paneer burji for me and my father started making a cake for me then he made a bread butter pudding for me that was my favorite and then we all three sat down and that journey where they were cooking and i was looking at them doing what they were doing with so much love and you have to believe this that that was one of the most beautiful moments of my life when i saw my mother and father only involved in what i would like or what would make me happy so i can never forget that day so that was the first time i felt the real happiness not with the gifts or not with the toys or not with whatever it was that moment in my life so i went on talking to her and then she asked me okay then what was the second one so i said well that was when i made good amount of money i was happy but i did not get the happiness that i wanted frankly speaking i made good wealth good contacts and i was very young so it made me very happy but i wouldn't say it was like the first happiness so anyway that was the second happiness so then i came to the third one and i said well uh that was when i bought all my cars and all my beautiful watches and you know all whatever luxury but then i felt that it was you know it was just very temporary and that lust of those valuable things it did not last very long though i was very happy but it not last long it was not that permanent kind of a then she said okay what was the fourth one as well well the fourth one was where i start getting a lot of name fame people knowing me you know people wanting to meet me and people wanting to write books on me but even there i did not get the happiness i had imagined though i was very happy but something was a miss you know well the fifth thing let me tell you it was a, a friend of mine he came to me and he said yaar ek jagah hai wahan par sab mixed wahan par log rehte hain muslim hai christian hai hindus hai and there are about 170 or 180 children That's very good. करना क्या है सो इसड यार उन सबके लिए व्हील चेयर लेने ठीक है ले ले बोलता मैं ले लेता हूं लेकिन यार हो सके तो परसों तू भी साथ चल और तू अपने हाथ से वहां पर दे दे सब ऐसे चलो ठीक है वाई नॉट so i went there and i gave these wheel chairs to these children with my own hands and i i saw a very एक अजीब सा एक ग्लो एक बहुत ही प्योर एक बहुत ही डिवाइन लुक खुशी और एक सब उनके चेहरे पे मुझे दिखा एंड आई सॉ दैम यू नो ऑल मूविंग अराउंड ऑन द व्हील चेयर एंड इट वाज लाइक दे वर हैविंग फन सडनली एक पिकनिक जैसा स्टार्ट हो गया था उनके लाइफ में दे वर ऑल सो हैप्पी सो व्हेन आई सॉ दिस हैप्पीनेस अ रियल काइंड ऑफ अ जॉय यू नो इट केम इनसाइड मी और जब मैं वहां से निकलने लगा व्हेन आई वुड लीव दैट प्लेस वन किड ही ग्रैब मी फ्रॉम माय लेग यू the child he didn't leave and he just stared at my face and held it tight so i bent down to him and i said beta tumhe aur kuch cheez chahiye do you need something else so the answer this child gave me not only made me happy but also changed everything in my life this was just few years back the child said to me i want to remember your face so that when i meet you in heaven 
आई विल बी एबल टू रिकोगनाइज यू एंड थैंक यू वंस अगेन सो गाइज जब उसने ये बात मुझे बोली ना तो दैट वॉज मोर देन ऑल द फोर हैपीनेस दैट आई जस्ट शेड विथ यू द फिफ्थ वन सो गाइज वॉट वुड वी बी रिमेंबर्ड फॉर आफ्टर वी लीव विल एनी वन डिजायर टू सी अर फेस अगेन वेर इट ऑल मैटर्स तो ये चीज बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है आई वॉन्ट एवरी बाई टू हियर दिस and i just pray that this feeling this thing happens with everybody it's a different feeling altogether guys to hum is duniya mein aaye hain wahi baat ghum kar ke aati hai ki kuch acha karke jaye and let's make somebody smile so i want to remember your face so that when i meet you in heaven i will be able to recognize you and thank you once again was the most beautiful thing that i could tell so thank you guys i want to share this with you all i love you all mwah